The long awaiting remake on the fourth part finally saw the light on day on March 24 and on the very first day became one of the leaders in terms of numbers of online in Steam and also gave rise of bunch of new memes that will haunt you for a long time in the corners of YouTube. Were the former developers of the Deuce able to repeat the success of the original? Is Ashlyn as useless as the original? And why now having heard Ada Wong you will not experience the former degree of excitement? You will learn this today in our video. to be different. The game meets us with the scene of the sacrifice of unknown woman, which was not in the original game, and which immediately makes it clear that this is no longer the game that was known in 2000s, and as it were, all these hints, availability, hips and new content. The intro of the original Resident Evil 4 is undoubtedly a wipe of those times. Looks that it's organic, albeit not very informative, but settings player for a certain mood. Here attention is more focused on the main character, revealing his psychological experience about the night in Raccoon City, and the drama that has been going on since those times. In the original part Krauser appeared in nowhere, but here he trains Leon, which will put aside a couple of unnecessary questions from beginners like what the hell is this and what does he want from us. Not everyone has played the Dark Side Chronicle, so thanks. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret, just between us. A lot of people have gone missing around here. I mean last week there was a search for some missing hikers. If people disappeared here and even more so tourists, maybe it was worth blowing up your ass and doing a more detailed investigation? What the hell are you doing with the police? He sure is taking his time. Did he fall in? Maybe you better go and take a look. Can you blow yourself up? Oh, watch the car. Wouldn't want to get a parking ticket. Understood, acceptable, justified. I already spoke about the visual components in a demo review, but I will repeat it again. It's fucking awesome. Many wondered whether the developers on the remake would be able to make the atmosphere equal to the original, and I can confirmly say yes. Playing this remake you feel is a wholly Japanese sperm flavored with the spirit of the old game poured into you, and you not only do not spit it, but swallow it asking for more as the adjective. Do not be surprised that everything hangs a little. I just noticed only after a while well, that the game automatically set me 120 FPS in the settings. In the original part when we returned to the car we could talk to the police, but no here. At the beginning on the original game, after leaving the car, Leon contacted with the Hannigan, after which they got to know each other and joked about her age. Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. Firstly, it's a scene for cutting it out, because how is this a white heterosexual man vorgally jogging with a woman, and secondly, a scene for showing her in a remake. The player is not presented with her, but it's presented, as a character we should already know. It may surprise you, but there are people who'd not played in the original. In the original, Leon approached the Resident Evil of the Splash Village with a clown fuck asking questions in the language of colonialists. I was wondering if he might recognize a girl in this photograph. Here Leon finally spoke Spanish. A trifle is a trifle, but nice to the flix it. Dear head straight from the 8 part. The facial model of the Leon was taken from Eduard Badalatula, the actor of the second game, which is quite logical. Now, if there is pretty face fit the image of Rookie Cop, there is the fans expected to see a more brutal version of Leon Kennedy, similar to original. Seen, of course, I slept rather from a crazy love for the game in 2005, so do not throw supplies because I now look like gambling grandfather. Judging by the little room, some of the assets are painfully reminiscent of assets from the 8th. It's not a Scene, it's an advocation, fuck off. Going on top secret mission of Salvation President's daughter, I'll take just one ammo magazine. In this photo, Ashlyn looked like she was passed around a whole village, but when they meet, she looked red and pretty. Unfortunately, in this remake, we were not allowed to return to the policeman, whose car was thrown into the real in the original. And it may seem to you that I am a sadist who did not want to see death only behind the scenes, but who may say no river, no cop? Cow still dropped loot. And yes, they brought back the peasants again. The old old Spanish currency that went out of circulation in 2002, when the game takes place in 2004. 
slightly modified, but the old song from the loading screen raises our ears again. Now Leon, in the style of Lionel Messi, fucks boxes with his feet, which is certainly convenient and epic. In the original we release the wolf from the trap, but here his fate turned up to be sadder. What did the wolf not please you bitches? Animal rights activists! I warn you in advance, trying to play stealth, breaking the boxes, most likely you will not be noticed, therefore you can safely bruise out them by scoring horse edish. In the game the opponents were left in the same way points, thanks to which you can fuck off the tumbler or go to the German suplex. In addition to this, I would like to know that depending on how close your opponent is, Leon changes his stance with the pistol. And also finishing off opponents with a knife was added to the game. In general throughout the game I had a feeling that the developers carefully approached such trifles, most likely I could with specialist, therefore Leon moves like a combat trained person, not like a Japanese monkey with a laser room. After Leon fell into the trap, for some reason his health did not decrease. The enemy is in the same place as the original. Not bad, but just a nice detail. Congratulations! Now after each door you do not need to watch a loading screen, because the developers have learned how to make seamless transactions. Whether I look binocular or not, they will burn it anyway. Replaying on hard, I checked that everything works according to the spirit, so don't even try to save it. In the future, any any observation through binoculars carry a purely plot meaning, and if you ignore it, the game will do everything on its own. It's not Resident Evil anymore, it's Metal Gear fucking. Stealth fans should get ready, because playing the first time you're obviously in a bad position due to not knowing the trajectory of the enemy. Only when you repass on a higher difficulty the stealth is revision to the fullest, making the game much more interesting. It is not necessary to run head on when you can cut off the village before raising the alarm. Without charging our transition, the first test on our way will be be a battle with the entire settlement, which, like in the original, will pretty much ruffle the nerves of beginners, especially when this young man enters the stage with a benzopal, which causes the S to shrink slightly as you, like a madness man, run into the house remembering where the chainless shotgun lies. That man at the door always spawns on anywhere. Chainsaw sewing the door. I have everything. It's nice to know that many things from the original are in the same place where they were before. Fans will agree with me that the game designers obviously didn't give a fuck about the original standing out not suck, but responsibly approach this issue knowing that if they do war somewhere, they will simply be raped by all Japan. Now you cannot use the enemy animation to avoid the attack of another enemy, so go to the tavern and start over. Playing on hardcore it seems that the crash bell sounded early and the game did not have time to mouse properly. The hallmark of the first half of the game has always been the initial location, which tested our strengths here the completely slightest reduced. Why was it necessary to add a video link effect if the support is boki toki? Falling from such a height, people tend to break something. There are hard to reach places that are accessible to only us thanks to satellites. Even the original, returning back to the same places with Schlin, she was only useful in advancing the plot. Here, thanks to this, we various rewards, which does not make the comeback so useless. But in the house of the original, there were records of photographs of Leon. Alas, they are not here. Blue medallions have returned to the game in the form of side quest ordered by the merchant without certain mini locations. Throughout the game, we will repeatedly receive chuck assignments which forces the player to carefully study every corner of certain rewards. It is good? Well, of course, because running with the raised and lower hack and inspecting every centimeter in what I have been waiting for, in the style of Tomb Dog there are little more options for combining herbs, which means that, like a true Astaman, most of the time you will be crafting all sorts of C plus C plus F. Also in this part, the crafting system of ammunition from 2 and 3 magnified. For this we need gunpowder, who types of material to choose from and for some recipes they cost money. Certainly something was cut out and something was embodied. No, I am not talking about hair moins. In the original the locations resembled of the sandy corridors, which is partly the same here, because the remake is linear as possible. However, various searches in the right items, tasks and other activities make each mini location full and interesting, which could not be said about its predecessor. I'm sorry, but I purposely rushed here headlong to check if my pebbles were still in the place and you know what? They cut the running around from the ballstone. Bitches. Yes, this garbage is a calling card for the first resident. What the hell have you done? And instead we got just stone collapse, which is not even close to our cringe, but such a favorite pebble. Birds still lay down instead of tentacles in stacked spinels. If you have already decided to make a game more realistic, then do not stick precious stones into the nests, or after the stone did you suddenly come to the senses. I have a question. What is this entrance is blocked by a closet, which even Leon pushed aside and attempts. How we are going to get of later, even if the basement that one was hammered with nails. Oh, there. Not this guy. Who are you? Okay, stop right there. 
First, where did the penthouse cutscene of the route how kick off? Secondly, why does he immediately introduce Las Plagas to him, if in the original it was revealed better by showing a separate scene, and here it was replaced with little monologue with the sun faced. Meet Luis Serra, the best man of this game, whose plot role was grown significantly compared to the original, for which thanks to the developers. Judging by the documents, he is 28 years old now, but looking at him, I would give all 40. You took all of his stuff, let him claim the seal but didn't notice the calm device in his ear. Over here, stranger. Whee! They got the merchant back! The symbol of war is not only a stone that they removed the fucking reason, but also a merchant with his iconic image and her worst acting. The new actor was able to achieve the most approximate sound of the lines, and the developers diversified the dialogues and jokes that he says from time to time. This weapon exhibitionist will not only buy you cans of javelin from you, which can now be improved by inserting pebbles, but also sell new types of weapons that were not in the original part, and subdue Yoknol with arm. More. We have scenes here and I keep praising and praising in the game, so I put a minus in. Fucking dynamites deal damage before the animation fishes. Exploding red barrels splash them. The artificial intelligence of opponents has become better. If you do not have time to finish someone off, be prepared to the fact that this bastard with strict fuck will chase you at all to Raccoon City. Much to our regret for the fans, the remake doesn't jumps out to the window when he sees Ado and calmly moves away from the room. Bring back Shinji Mikami, let him correct this a little, distract his grandfather from evil within. I've got that intel you require. Umbrella? Where without Umbrella in any part of the Resident Evil. At least now we know the backstory of the characters better, maybe it will even be a pity for him. The developers nevertheless foresaw the magic pizduli from the fans of the series and returned to Wolf in a Trap. During the game we will collect keys to open certain boxes in the game. How these keys are suitable to each lock only God knows. The security system is poor here. Because on the fall of this tower I almost shit myself. We're playing horror, so I'm sorry, but I keep mind that I'm screw up, it's important. <laughs> Fucking mutated wolves. Are these wolves not dogs like his second part, right? Having obtained fuel to the boat, we went to the lake, where according to the tradition, a large mutated catfish was waiting for us. As in the original game, we should poke him with harpoons, which are still for some reason in infinite number. Something is wrong with me or hell knows, but the boss fight with the fish in the remake seemed to me much simpler than original, and in the end, unfortunately, the op didn't catch to Leon's leg. In the remake, the capabilities of Settler and the influence of the parasite on Leon's body were significantly expanded, so in the future he through Wi-Fi will receive cutscenes from her potential boss. Elon Musk would be crazy about this wireless method. In the battle of El Gigante the wolf again helped us, and again we have the opportunity to jump out the back and beat the parasite with a knife, but be prepared for the fact that the knife can break at any moment and you will get an L bait. I don't know about you, but I didn't particularly like the mechanic with a knife from a juice, ok when you parry a chainsaw strike, but breaking when finishing on enemies seriously. We finally meet up with Ashlyn, who looks extremely… Uh, attractive. From the very first minutes according to the tradition, she begins to interplay, but not everything is so simple. In the plot aspect on interaction, one trace gradually increasing a component because the original it was cut more. Now together with her we can intercept the Wi-Fi signal address to the enemies and approximately understand that now they are ordered to give us salary pleasants, which as it were is obvious from without it. Shame on the developers for not having Ashlyn instead of skirt shorts. And why didn't she construct on ground floor? Here's the rusty ladder from the ground. This creature will no longer call you pervert, as it was in the original. Oh, you pervert! Yes, 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 yes. Except that your last full fantasies will not come true. Don't even try. Look, she was learned to walk down the stairs by herself. Japanese feminism is moving in the right direction. Slowly but surely. Now Ashlyn does not have a health bar and there are two modes, breaking right in the back on the head and run away from the city. In the event of attack of opponents, if she is hit, she will fall and no way without the help of Leon will not be able to get up. Despite this incident in the run beach run, she simplified our text quite and well, in able to avoid enemies on her own, albeit not always successfully. I was waiting for this in the remake, but alas, at the first meeting of Ashlyn and the merchant, she does not comment in any way, but at the same time, 
time she constantly witness under my ear that she will definitely catch a cold from the rain and comments on everything. Hey, I see you found your missing senorita. Senorita has a name and it's Ashley. You are? Now I am sure that even a Japanese began to pay attention to agenda. How could Ashley's iconic phrase about ballistics be cut out? I see that the president's equipped his daughter with ballistics too. Are you completely nuts there? First the rock, then the boobs jokes, what next? After a long siege at home, as a result of which I got couple of pizduli, I am grateful to the developers that they made Ashlyn much more useful. Instead of sitting in hiding and winning, as she did in the original, here she does not sit idle and in fact save her life on her heroes. Hey, got a smoke? I do, the kind you like. Now where's the amber? What did they do with Ada Wong's voice? Why does she should like someone Habalka from the market who sells me cigarettes by the price? What is really impossible to keep the voice actors from the second game who perfectly suited her image? A small remark, I think the best voice acting of Ada Wong in the voice acting of the six. Yes, I'm a Copperfield. Unfortunately, after the siege of the house, we were not given the choice to let go, as it was in the original, and therefore we fight against the sisters with chainsaw. Alas, but I still put a scene, because I wanted to see how El Gigante spits Ashlyn like a spinner of Hinder. Come, child. Ashley, run! Did he mutate so fast? And we weren't show the pathetic scene of how the boss location slowly turned another Krakazabra. If in the original air there was alarming, here he looked like some kind of closet from the 90s, which squeezes factories from the honest hard workers. The importance of the boss in the fail because it is not enough. It looked less brutal. Even his eye, which in the original opened the exit, did just decoration here. In general, due to the fact that this role is meaningless, most likely a meme location with lift was cut out, where we shoot enemies and those funny voice acting fell down from this. When I get to the castle, I don't feel like I overcome something heavy and finally got out of the village. Yes, they show well completely mixing the old developments with the new ones, but personally it seems to me that where it was were emphasizing. They either reduced or removed the location altogether, while the corridors placed to the original. On the contrary, sketch it. For what these guys fucking us with catapult when they needed Ashlyn alive? On the other note, I'd like that Leon constantly asks Ashlyn how she feels about acting like a true professional. Awesome. Nice shot. Also, I like Ashlyn's reaction to all of this. Good replacement to her reaction from the original. I would like you to hand the girl there over to me. Now. Yeah, fat chance, Ramon. The girl's just fine with me. Did you see how slyly she smiled? Apparently due to the fact that the developers again cut out the cut melon. No thanks, bro. Why? What the hell did you do to you? What did the stone do to you or not that? Can't see me. When it appeared in the original, I rather went that scared, but here I am. By the way, unlike the original, there is standing still, you get hit in the face by him, here you can really see that the blind ball and thus the battle with him is much more interesting. For 20 minutes I could not understand why there was swords in the wall and four paintings, and only then I realized that the last blood bit was behind the bars, and therefore I will put a scene on the game for once again putting me down, in which she is absolutely right. It's a pity, but in the original this level was harder. Looks like the right place. You okay? I think so. Instead of worrying about her, worry about your own skin. Foolish little lamb. 
Why don't you stop the knife with your hand and grab her by the wrist and interview her before she runs away in such stupid way? And if they need her alive, what are you afraid of? They won't have a second president's daughter. An interesting new addition to the game, a red cloak didn't too. Thanks to his ult, it able to blow up the head of opponents and summon crookhead from them. But most of all, I like the fact that abilities of the stunk also affect the gameplay. This mechanic allows a little better look the degree of Leon infection. It just a pity that doesn't burst. You can stop right there, Leon. Would it make me use this? Would you? Can you keep your finger on the trigger? And somehow unconvincing. Interesting. <laughs> Try using knives next time. Better for close encounters. Minus the scene for the high quality standing of the fight, and then the scene for the fact that they removed the original movesets of Ada with her cup of pistol to a slow mo. I see the developers enjoy cutting off memes for the sake of realism. <laughs> Said meeting you once was enough. How, How did he hear that Leon was saying if visually this device does not work very modern? Share technology with me. And I the only one who thinks this place remind me of random location from Dunk Souls? They want to kill you from all sides? There is. There is huge garbage throwing all sorts of shit of you? There is. The main character fucking with what was happening? There is too. Well, the Japanese did something, yes. Apparently it was about this. She must have been terrifying. I, I know. You too? Woman, it was worth seeing we were in the same shit. So immediately use the pussy, Leonchik is good. And in no case I ran away from again. So, uh, you do a lot of missions like this? Well, yeah, but I'm not used to having such good company. Is that a compliment? <laughs> Take it however you want. Now undress. Finally some fucking decent food. The puzzle with pictures and a set of table my favorite, because continuing these forks and knives is what we have to do in first Resident Evil. And Ashlyn feels better closer to the kitchen. Hey, Leon, there's some armor. Bet you could use it like a bulletproof vest. <laughs> Little old-fashioned for my taste. Mm, too bad. I think you'd look pretty dashing. Maybe you are already fucking finally. We are finally allowed to play as Ashlyn, and it was fun in the original source. The gameplay for it is so interesting, and our opponents will be knights will a plug, which thanks to the miraculous blue lamp can be freezed and bossed. And today the best shot awards goes to cameraman, who knows how to correctly see the angle throughout the entire Resident Evil. It was wild. Falling into the shit drains has been a reward and instead of a hook Leon clangs to the chains and appeared of nowhere. But in general he is look better than in QTE from the original and therefore I will remove the scene. Good old Verdugo as well as doing this attack returning to us. However instead of the boomstick throw of the balloon in the ground here were cute of helium just pressing the green button. It turned out that I fired the fire the nitrogen button stopped working and I just left the elevator without killing him. I have no idea why it was so easy to live but oh well. The problem is we won't see him again and that's pretty weird. By the way in the game you can buy the character model and twist them and you please. My respect to the developers for the fact that the battle with El Gigante does not look as stuffy and original. The methods of killing them remained about the same but thanks to the participation of Louis the arsenal of capabilities has become wider and in general the location with the mine or the lottery began to took much more interesting than it was before. Why was I given another gun and why does the they have infinite ammo. Helping the two of you doesn't make up for it. I know that. But still, I don't want anyone else to get hurt. In that case, you better get serious. Don't you think that the remark Leon was made somehow painfully stuffy? In the original he has balance between seriousness and humor, while here he is joking it all like some kind of toxic schoolboy playing Dota. You know it means we're almost... <laughs> almost what? <laughs> 
At least in the remake his death does not look so cringe and uh, fits in the general surroundings. The first meeting with Krauser happened a little earlier, but I can safely say that Krauser and his storyline are the best the Resident Evil remake has managed to offer. What do you think? Right. Yes, Louis, they change and remove the stone in the remake. Sorry, Louis, no matter how how we try, but when you died in the original, you had to die in the remake. Also, I am sure many would vote for him to stay alive and return in a future game. You have been bestowed with lore settlers. You talk too much. You failed. <laughs> Finally you thought of shooting him, because in the original you had a lot of unused opportunities. Wait, where did the second Verduga go? And thanks to which Salazar merged with the flower and turned into a mutated wheat. And again we were not shown the transformation of the final boss on the location. Now this boss does not look as intimidating as it was in the original, but more like a rabbit tentacle shooting all at us. And since Leon is American, he can let some cook all black fuel. Don't think too hard, handsome. See you later. The cameraman throughout the game proved the management that his work is not useless. The story of my life. And why did these bitches cut off the meme phrase woman again? Women. Since when the Japanese afraid of feminists? What progressive technologies in 2004 in Outback of Spain? The military base was the best transferred living meme moments like burning dude and so on. Unfortunately they removed a funny tongue of the boobs, which I was very much looking forward in the remake. But there is one creature that has become even uglier dead in the original, namely... Fucking regenerator. No matter how scary it may see in the original, here it combination of dark laboratory and sounding makes, it built a whole factory of bricks. Not only that, the regenerator has become even more aggressive, so it also jumps on you while lying on the ground. Therefore, do not even think about attacking him without special optics, otherwise you will simply waste your cartridges in vain. Ashlyn's visuals and ballistics are getting closer and closer to canon. Wrecking ball. I got this. Is this what they teach kids in school these days? Have you never heard of driver's ed? Did you also learn how to operate a crane and fuck the walls with a huge ball of driving courses? That was awesome! I think you might have found your calling. Good job. O on your return you will need on concrete and construction site. Don't you think that platform somehow descends too slowly? Maybe she should hurry up. Maybe someday I'll become an agent like you. What do you think? We could protect the US from any and all threats. Is that right? Well, either way. First, we have to make it out of here. It is possible to give Leon from the original part such as Ashlyn, cause this Leon reminds me of some 8th grader syndrome. In a small camp before the battle with Krauser, there are notes where it described in more detail because of what he went a little bit like Yuko. Do not miss this. I can say that expanded dialogues with Krauser look much better than random men with a scar on the floor with a fuck, who for some reason wanted to kill us in the original. The first half of the duel implemented easier and not long in the original. I've asked the question before, but would it be considered a fair fight when you are genetically engineered machine that dodges bullets and Leon is just a trained fighter? In the second phase of the duel, they for some reason abandoned the concept of the timer until the tower exploded, which in the original was quite annoying and made the testicles sweat. Otherwise the boss fight with Krauser turned out to be worthy, but first of all in terms of plot which was fully revealed, especially the fact that Leon's flicks is slowly floating and in future projects the universe he will completely hit drunk. Respect to the developers that they didn't make the flared moment like I won't kill you and like that.
saved at the last minute cliche. And you don't think that Sadler's face in reminisce of actors who played Voldemort? Or am I trustfully revived Harry Potter in penetration for the next Hogwarts Legacy video? Glitches due to Las Plagas for some reason reminded me of Iron and his legs due to black ones. Only unlike the Metro, there are no blacks here and everyone only white. Previous tests have shown that the device is not yet quite ready to use. However, our main characters not only figured how it works, but also miraculously survived. Also, given that Ashlyn can't even get without our help, I'd watch her pick Leon on the floor, put him on a chair and perform the operation in such a way that he doesn't even wake up in hellish pain. Finally, we saw a normal mutation of the boss, even if he final won. For those who haven't played the game yet, but played the original, I still recommend starting the game in hardcore, because for those familiar with the original, even the final boss will seem like a child's walk, with familiar weak points and moveset. Unfortunately, I expected more from the boss fight with him, but it turned out a little dumb, like with the Sadler character himself. As the final boss and in general the main antagonist of the game, he does not feel like such. If we consider him against the background of the same Krauser, who made managed to kill a positive character and pretty much give us the shit giving us interesting battle in the final. And therefore, for personally, the final boss is just another huge crocodile. Fortunately, Capcom does not deliver from old traditions and others still help us by throwing a rocket launcher. You know, I could put in a word with my dad, have you assigned to my detail, if you're interested. You don't need me. You proved you could handle yourself. Either saying between you and Ada, I will choose Chris. Roostakunder 1, do you read me? Come in. I said come in, is this thing even on? Why not answer her so that she closed her mouth? In the post credit scene, we were shown one famous man who wear glasses even in dark rooms. And since they showed it to us, I feel that we should expect a remake of 5 or something like that. Get ready to shoot in inhabitants of Africa and beat the stone with your fists. For the latter, I'm not sure because even here they carved in. Summing up, I want to rate the game of Salt 8, removing two balls for several bosses fight that they removed and in general the scenes that talk about today. Ahead of us is a DLC with a plot of Ada and the mercenaries mod, which we also have to play. And you must subscribe to our channel, like and repost this video.